Hello and welcome to Tuesday's spelling lesson. So today we're going to be thinking about this digraph here in the middle of the page. And this is the or digraph made up of O and R and together they make one sound, the or sound. And we're really familiar with this because this is one of the first ways that we learn that makes the or sound. But there are other ways of writing the or sound. So we've got a U making the or sound. We've got a W making the or sound. So this makes or, or, and or. But there's also something else tricky that OR does when it's together, and that sometimes it can actually make a completely different sound when it's together. Sometimes it can make the er uh sound. And we're going to be thinking about that a little bit later in the lesson. So the first thing I'd like you to do on a piece of paper or with paint or with chalks or whatever you like, um, I'll tell you what would be nice if it's nice and sunny outside, um, just get a paintbrush and some water and go and write as many or words as you can on the wall outside just with water or pen and paper, anything you like. But I would like you to think of as many words as you can that have the or sound. So at this point, don't worry too much about how you spell them. I just want to see how many you can do. When you have finished your list, you can unpause and watch the rest of the video. OK, so here we have a picture prompt to help us. And all of our pictures today are going to have the or sound in them or the er uh sound represented using the or digraph. So this here is a horse. So I'm going to sound it out. Or here we go. But it actually has an e on the end as well. Now here you can see the or sound. And what I can do is I can put some sound buttons on this. So We've got, then we've got or, and we've got the E as well that we know we need to add on there. So that's horse, and that's a nice, easy one. Let's have a look at the next one. Okay, so now we have, hopefully, you know what they're called when they're in space. They are called an astronaut, an astronaut. And this has got a different type of um or way of, of spelling or in it so let's have a look at that one i'm gonna sign out to help me ast or astro or okay ast or can you see where the or sound is in this word it's actually here. So we've got a st -r -o -n -o -t, astron -ort. OK, so that's a different way of making the or sound. Astronaut. Ah, now this is one of those tricky ones that I was telling you about before, because we know that this is a worm. So I'm going to sound out the word worm. Uh, mm. So you might think that we're going to use ER to spell this one, but it's a really, really tricky one because actually we use the OR sound to write worm. Let me show you. And this is one of those words that we just have to know that it's different. So in your head, you might say warm, just so you remember how to spell it. But you can see that it's got the OR digraph in the middle there which is actually in this word making the er uh sound, worm, worm, but it's spelt using O-R. Oh, here's another one, and we're thinking here about what the baby is doing, and it's having a little crawl, crawl, crawl. Let's have a go at writing that one. Crawl. Cruel. Now, these two at the start are separate, even though they sound very, very close together. If you if you stretch them out, they're actually making two sounds. Then we've got the 
all, and then we've got the all, all. So what I would like you to do is have a look at these words, and then if you can just write these digraphs at the top, um, we'll have a go at sorting them. This one here, or this is the one where or makes the er uh sound. And then we've just got or, 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 er. Uh. So let's have a go at a couple of them. So I'm going to have a go at this one here and I'm going to find the or sound. Oh, it went flying. The or sound, which is there. So d it looks like it's an e, but I know it's going to make the I sound. D I know or dinosaur. So I'm looking and I can see a U. So this one is going to go in here. So I've sorted that one. I'm just going to read through the other ones and you can write them in the correct column on your piece of paper. So here we've got world, world. Hmm, I can't hear the all sound in that one. Have a think about where that one might need to go. Cork, like a cork in a bottle. Word, word. Horse, crawl, saw, draw, fort, like a castle fort, August, claw, astronaut, horn, worm, work. If you need to rewind the video and read them along with me, you can do that a few times until you're really, really happy with what the words say. And then I want you to have a go at recording them in the correct place on the table, please. Once you've finished, um, if you come back and have a check, I'll go on to the next slide and I'll show you the answers. So pause the video here and have a go at doing this job for me. OK, you're back. Let's hope that you've done your work and you're not having a sneaky little peek. So let's have a look at the next slide and you can mark yours then. OK, so this is them all sorted out. I've got my ORs here, O-R. I've got my AWs here, my AUs here, and my OR making the ER sound here. So hopefully you've got all of those right. OK, I'll see you next time.